Hi everyone, thank you so much for clicking on the video and today I will be talking about my experience at We Are Sukalawats, US Fan Meet and Greet. Greets uh, took place on September 2nd and September 3rd, which is the start of Labor Day weekend. Oh my goodness, I have so much fun. Um, if you guys don't know who Wei Sukulawa is, he is a very, very famous Thai actor. So basically in Thailand, if you watch a lot of Thai lakuns, the Thai dramas, um, there's two really big channels, um, and these channels are the ones that puts on um, the lakuns or the dramas, and there's two really big ones. It's either channel three or channel seven, and these actors are like exclusive to only that channel. So basically, Wei Sukulawa is the most uh, popular actor in channel seven at the moment, and he has been for a long time. So um, it was so exciting when I first heard that he was actually doing a fan meet and greet here in the U.S., and I was really surprised. I'm like, oh my goodness, I can't believe they got him because he is this humongous star and uh, very deservingly so too because he's really big in um, humanitarian work. He does a lot of charity, so he's not only a really good actor, he's also, um, also a really good guy. And um, aside from that, he's also, he sings pretty well. I do a uh, freelance MC on the side. I do host events, um, MC for events as well. And so I was really hoping to be able to be a part of this event. Um, so on the day of, actually, I was like thinking about it for a couple of weeks. I'm like, I'm going to contact them. I'm going to do it. I'm going to contact them and ask them um, if I can be the MC for this event. So I was like, okay, tomorrow I'm going to wake up and I'll write them a letter. And I will write them emails, shoot them an email and see how it goes. And um, it's like the craziest thing because as I was typing out that email, I got a message on Facebook. It was almost like the universe heard me and the universe answered me before I had even uh, finished writing this email. So I was really, really grateful. And then I ended up doing the um, Sacramento and the Fresno uh, meet and greet. And um, I was really excited for this event because I felt like um, I was right at home being a fan girl. I felt like I was in my element because this is basically what I love to do. I, I fan girl. The Sacramento event was on uh, September 2nd on a Friday and I traveled up there by myself. I was really hoping that I was going to get to meet him so I can get the jitters out of the way but um, unfortunately there was some miscommunication for his team and the organizing team and I think they had missed each other's flight somehow so um, I actually didn't get to meet him until everybody else got to meet them, him. I got to the venue, uh, we set up, um, the fans arrived and there was oh so good to see everyone. Oh, she has such beautiful fans. I just, I was I'm just mesmerized with all the girls. I'm just looking at them, checking out their styles. I'm like, dang, he has some good looking fans. Or everybody was so beautiful. I was a wide age range as well. Uh, Cause we have the really young girls, teens, and then we have like the mid twenties. And then there's a lot of grannies there because he is, um, he does sing a lot of folk songs. So a lot of the grannies like his folk songs too. So a lot of them showed up and that was so sweet. Uh, where shows uh, showed up around like I want to say almost nine o'clock. <laughs> yeah, he's slim, he's tall, dark, and handsome. Oh my goodness. And his smile. Oh. I'm sure you guys can see in the pictures. He is so handsome. Um, so he got on stage, he sang two songs, and then we went up and there was a QA session. So I had before, previously, I had gone around and I had asked people um, questions that they would have liked to ask him. Which role is your favorite so far? Favorite one coming this afternoon? Uh, action. Yeah! 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 Yeah!
Especially love seeing him with the, the little kids or like the elders because um, he's so polite with them. Uh, there was a lady I can't remember it was Sacramento or Fresno. She had brought like all the DVD stuff covers of his dramas. I think she had like seven of them, and he signed every single one of them for her. And she just had a smile on her face. It was just the cutest thing. So when she was done, uh, when she was done. Uh, with her pictures and autograph, uh, she had came and I asked her, um, So basically I asked her if the person was as handsome as the one in the movies, and she said, <laughs> So basically she said, No, he's actually better looking on screen, but the, per the, the person is more charming. I did get some videos, and fans did uh, record some video, and I happened to be part of the video too. Sorry for uh, intruding on your videos. Uh, there was a video that my friend has shown me, and it was like the first time I got on stage with him in Fresno, and he had to Y me, which is like basically the, the Thai greeting that you put your hands together and you greet. The way that I had to Y him, um, basically um, in like all, all Asian culture, um, the elders, you're supposed to respect your elder. And obviously he's much older than me, but when I had gone on stage, I had just Y him really briefly and I had stopped my Y before he had stopped his Y. My friends are making fun of me. They're like, oh, how? How disrespectful! You're supposed to why him longer than he's supposed to why you because he is your older and you're his younger. So, we are ka. I apologize. I don't know Thai culture, which is like shit. I was really surprised at some of these events because we had I had uh, people come up to me and tell me that they enjoy watching um, our show between sisters. And uh, so we asked for um, I want to say signatures, not autographs, because I don't think I. Am. <laughs> I'm uh, qualified to call my signatures autograph yet, but they had to ask for some signatures and also pictures, and I was so humble and grateful, and I'm like, oh my god, they actually want to take pictures of me, so thank you so much to the ones that came up to me and asked for the pictures, and whether or not you did want a picture, you just wanted to make you feel better, I really appreciate it. Just and I do want to address, I, I have seen a couple of comments online that some um, some of the attendees weren't happy with um, the amount of time that he was on stage. They wanted him to be on stage longer and things like that. And I just want to say that uh, I think that it's always best to give um, constructive criticism uh, and also give them a feedback on um, things that they can do better, uh, go step by step, what things that you didn't like, things that you did like, so that next time when they do this kind of event, Against, they know they, what things to keep and what things to improve on and I really do ho hope that the good does outweigh the bad. I was, I'm so grateful for this experience because as a fan girl, being there and being able to MC that even greet, the fan girl inside of me was just doing cartwheels all day long because um, all the ladies there I felt uh, Totally in my element. I really enjoy being there with all the ladies. Enjoy being there with his team as well. And I really hope that next time that um, if there's more meaning green, that I'll also be a part of it. And I will be working towards being a better MC. Um, before I go, we did get I did get a T-shirt. Check out this awesome T-shirt. And I'm sorry, it's kind of dirty because I've been wearing it a lot. And it says I Heart Mia, and in the middle here, I don't know if you guys can see, but. Um, 
it's just basically say I love you and like thank you and like Hmong and Thai Laos. It's just like a really cool shirt. So I wear this to sleep a lot. Yeah. Um, yeah. I don't have anything else to say. <laughs> I'm just really grateful for this opportunity and thank you guys so much for watching this video and we will see you next time.